The stage was set. Our heroes had their monstrosity manufacturer at point-blank range. The nature-loving craven despised the creature before him, seeing her as a defiler, a violator of Mother Earth. But Shuzu, a scholar himself, saw that it was curiosity that led her into darkness. He begged for his friends to spare her life. But that witch, she used the kindly orc's compassion to her wicked advantage, spreading her razor-sharp wings once more and stabbing them into the bard. In that moment of shock, she cast invisibility as she attempted to fly away. But Kubrick was not deceived, because that dumbass bird was still wrapped in a big old chain. Heavy and trapped, Craven did his favorite thing. Until she fell, helpless to the ground. Craven slid toward the unconscious Shuzug, kicking up dirt all over his body. But he administered first aid, so it was fine. Kubrick approached the Arakokra. He raged within, not wishing to take a life unjustly, but knowing he was the only one who could. Again she begged. She pleaded. Kubrick shed a tear before stabbing her with his spear several times. And it seemed that for the moment, they were finally safe. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe to stay up to date with our awesome adventures.